sound show. Yo, I love sound. <laughs> oh, goodbye. You may recognize this area as the Sound Drone Workbench. I've removed the old sign. And we're gonna put up the, the new sign. First thing I had to do was to trim the paper to size to match the stencil I had purchased. Now it's the perfect size, we can add our graphics. And here's the stencil we're gonna be spraying. I don't know if you can see it there. This is the sound show. Get your stencil centered where you want it on the paper. And then what you want to do is you want to make sure that you tape off anywhere that you can get overspray. Like see this little area right here? There's over it's gonna be overspray and overspray will make it look bad. So you want to tape off anywhere that there's overspray. Okay, looks like we're ready to spray. Well, see how we did. There's my fingers. <laughs> Not too bad. You know, it turned out okay, but it just, it, it, it needs something else. Well, it's a good thing I got these stencils. I think it turned out pretty all right, but there is one last thing that we gotta do before we can install it. I think you guys might know what it is. A thorough blessing. Oh. <coughs> now she's ready. Let's go install it. We'll put it straight. <laughs> How's that? How's that look now? I think I may have to get a new poster because that one's kind of getting old and tattered. But I like my sound show sign now. That looks cool. The only problem I see with these stencils is now that I've made the sign, what do I do with it now? It's just gonna sit in my garage. Oh well. Sound drum.